morning, Aiko. Oh, hey, Belly. What's wrong? Seems like something's bothering you. Yeah, life. <laughs> How are classes going? Uh, I don't want to talk about that. Mm, well, I think I have just the thing. I'm headed to the beach to work in a few poses. You should join me. Nothing like a little exercise to melt that stress away. Uh, not today. I'm just not feeling it. Will I at least be seeing you this weekend at the studio? I'll be there. I don't think I have anything else going on for once. Great! Can't wait. See you there. Dude. Bro. Asian chicks? Don't even get me started. I have, like, the worst case of yellow fever ever. Ever. Like a yellow plague. This is a tough approach. She's kind of in a shitty mood, so say something stupid to try and cheer her up. It doesn't matter what. The stupider, the better. <sighs> like I said, I enjoyed this game. I did not remember at all, like, how how not PC this game is. That You don't say stuff like that. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Let's talk with her. How are we going to get the teacher to be our friend? I'm going to start with, fuck these birds, am I right? <laughs> no, I like the birds. Then I would say, ah, but for real, what's up? You look a little bummed over here. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm just trying to relax, enjoy a little downtime between classes. I teach up at UOG. You know the place? It's like the only university in the city for some reason. UOG. Does UOG stand for University of Girls? Cause that's that's pretty clever. Uh oh yeah, what do you teach? Well, I'm supposed to be a physics professor. Let's just leave it at that. <laughs> I'm glad you came over here. I needed a good laugh. The kids call me Miss Yumi, but you can call me Aiko. Aiko. Okay, so Aiko is who who I wanna I wanna date. I wanna go all the way with Aiko. Okay. Uh, same thing. Everything's the same about her. Honeybee shows us. Ooh, girl finder. Sorry. Uh, this. Yeah, Honeybee shows us what she likes, what she doesn't like, and then has all the same information that could be filled in. All right. So she likes sexuality. She hates talent. That's interesting. From a teacher? That's interesting. All right. Let's uh let's see what gifts she has. Uh let's see. She loves a yo-yo. Hang on. Hang on. Her her favorite gift type or she loves the toy gift type and her unique gift type is J uh Japan. Okay. Got it. So that would be yo-yo and flower seeds on oh, no, this garden. Oh, the unique is over here. Chopsticks. Well, that's that's a little on the nose, don't you think? Okay, let's get her a yo-yo. Can we get her some drinks too, or is it too early in the day? It's never too early in the day for teachers. Uh, let's see. <laughs> let's see. Her alcohol tolerance is high, and her favorite drink is sake. Okay. So is that here? A quick little quick aside, you can easily you don't have to jump back and forth between everything. Everything everything that you need to access is not on this screen here. You could just jump to in the honeybee. Uh sake, sake, two hundred. Oh, we got just enough. Alright, let's get her a yo yo. Oh shit. Now I have to get you something. And some sake. Never a bad time for a stiff drink. Like I said, how'd I know? How do I know? Okay, let's take a look. We got we got stuff in the mail, right? Or did it just show up in our inventory? Yes, it did. Okay, so we got two gifts already. Our first is the silver ring. Uh, it costs four cinnamon and it consumes ten random tokens on the grid, uh, and it won't be a broken heart or a joy token, so it won't be something that would hurt us or anything that would uh, give us extra turns, which is good. Only thing is, it's random. And we got the red tulip, which consumes all sexuality tokens on the grid, which we actually don't want since she likes sexuality. Okay, so none of these gifts will actually help us too much. I'm going to equip the soul ring. Oh, I'm sorry, the silver ring. <laughs> no? I'm in the wrong? 
I'm in the wrong. I'm going to equip that. I mean, we could equip this now. It doesn't mean we have to use it. All right. And then we can go on our very first actual date. Uh, Aiko, Miss Yumi, would you like to... Would you like to... Did I give her... No, I didn't buy the Japan. Would you like to go on a date? Yeah, all right. Why not? All right, ladies and gentlemen. The game is on. The game is on. Look at this. We've got the whole rink to ourselves. All right, so we're at the ice rink. Uh, like I said, uh, as you succeed on dates, they become a little bit harder to complete. The last one, the tutorial one with Kyu, we need 100 uh, points to, to win. This time, we need 120. I think it increases by 20 each time, not entirely sure. Doesn't matter too much. The trick to doing well in like the really high levels is to successfully get a free move without having the one that you do be the move. Like for example, I don't I want to get a free move, but I don't want to move one of these shapes to do so. Otherwise I'm I'm just wasting a turn. I'm just wasting a turn. You want to chain it? You really want to chain it so that it does itself. It handles itself. Let's see. I need to get some sentiment because I know things are going to get ugly up in here. Up in here. I'll do that. Get that out. Get that out of the way because it looks like all these are going to band up against me. They're going to rise. Let's see. If you match more than, I believe if you match four of one shape, you get this special shape, which is worth a lot more. <laughs> see? See all that? You can see all the numbers getting done over here. Uh, let's see. Let's move that there. That. I'm trying to find a way I can move. Dang it. I think I might have messed it up. It'll be all right. It'll be all right. We're here now. We're here now. It's getting ugly. It's getting ugly. Let's see. We got 10 turns left. Okay, we need to start. We just need to start grabbing these here. We, need, we don't even have enough sentiment to use anything. Come on. Come on. Come on. What we got? What we got? What we got? What we got? I'm looking everywhere. I'm looking everywhere. How about if I do that? Oh, that's going to mess up. No, it's not. No, it's not. It'll be all right. It'll be all right, because here's what we can do. Let's see. We can do that. Okay, you need five for that shape. Excuse me. Excuse me. Let's do that. All right, I think we, now we just need to. Now we just need to. There we go. Uh, let's see. I can't move this here. I can move it here, though. Damn it. Damn it. Okay, I wanted to avoid it, but I mashed a broken heart, which actually takes points away. It doesn't give us less points than it normally would. It takes points away. And that's no good. Let's get this out of here before I monk it up again. Before I monk it up again. Let's see, we got three turns left. This date is not... Let's see, this will turn all broken hearts into passion tokens. Let's give it a second. Things can't go horrible if I use this now. Oh, I need one more sentiment for that, don't I? Here's what we do. All right, we need 30. 30 and three moves we can do. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Let's see. How about we... Oh... Let's do that. How about we do that one? Uh, I'm trying to find the best moves. I'm trying to find the best moves. How about we move that out the way? There we go. There we go. I found it. There we go. All right, we could do 12 points. 12 points is simple, simple, bow bimple. 
How about we do that? Oh shoot, one turn left? I'm scared. I think this will be enough. Yeah, there we go. There we go, we did it. We did it, everybody. Successful first date. About time a man who knows what he's doing shows up in my life. Nice little afternoon date at the ice rink. All right. So after this date, we unlocked her gold chateau outfit. Let's go check that out real quick. Uh, what I can do on this same screen for the girl, for Aiko, uh, from preferences, we can go to her details. And then from there, we can go to, oh, not her collection. This is all the things that we've given her. I'm guessing these are all the things that appeal to her at all. And then her her style. One of the things we could do is change both her haircut or her outfit. So what we just saw while she was at the ice rink was the gold chateau. So she could wear that as well. Uh, to be honest, I think I think I like this one a little bit more. I think I like this outfit a little bit more. Let's ride with this one for a while. Or we could put on random. Random will make it so that anytime she pops up, it'll choose between. Uh, one of her five outfits, and then one of her five haircuts. All right, so we, like I said, we're focusing on Aiko here. We're focusing on Aiko, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get her some more stuff. I'm gonna get her some more things and stuff. Uh, now these items all switch out over time. So if we come back, if we go out to another location to meet another girl, we might not see uh, these same items. If we come back to Aiko, we may not see these same items. Uh, let's see. Let's get her, her chopsticks. And then she also likes flower seeds. Let's get her those. All right, so we can hand her some chopsticks. God, you are so racist. <laughs> I said that. I said that. I said that. All right, I'll admit it. You did good. All right, looks like we unlocked another outfit. Let's take a gander. I'll show you this this menu in a second. Give me give me one. Give me one. I think this is what the money was for. Uh, if we look at Aiko, if you look at Aiko, we have her outfits. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, her haircut. She got another haircut. So her youthful haircut instead of the academic one would look like this. Not a fan. She don't look. She honestly, she looks a little bit older, to me. We're gonna stick. You know what? Yeah, let's stick with academic. Let's stick with one haircut so that she's identifiable until we get one that's better. <laughs> okay. Very quickly, the traits menu. If I had enough honey, that's that in the top right corner. If I had enough honey, what I can do is buy these items, which I don't give to anybody. They stay with me. But they make it so that whenever I match an appropriate um, gem, it does better for me. It, do, it, do, it works better in my favor. So, for example, this one will be the talent. If I bought the flute, it would make it so the talent matches give us a, a bonus affection points. Uh, same thing with flirtation, romance, and sexuality. Uh, for passion, what it does, it increases the maximum passion level to six and... I believe here's how passion works. I believe as our passion level gets higher, as we match the, the heart shapes, the, the pink heart shapes, uh, we get bonus points. Not entirely sure. I've never really understood how that one worked. I don't think it's explained. If it is, I'm just an idiot. Sensitivity makes it so the broken hearts don't deal as much damage when we do match them by mistake. They will. They, there's, I don't think there's ever a point where they don't deal damage, but... They make it so it deals less damage than it does right now. Right now, it deals a lot of damage if we match them. Uh, Charisma makes it so the power tokens multiply the affection earned from a match by 1.75. So this will increase our uh, affection multiplier. And then luck. On occasion, if we match... Let's see. When I matched the five blue shapes, uh, they gave me a special one in the middle. This will make it so that... I have a greater chance of it going, it, it working. It's, it's actually really good to have this one all the way up. Okay, so that's one date with Aiko. How do we date Aiko again? We got to come back tomorrow. You can't date anybody more than once in, a, in any given day. So today is Monday. It's the first of the month. 
what we have to do, or it's the first day rather. What we have to do is leave and find Aiko again tomorrow on Tuesday. Uh, that's actually really simple. But since since there's a bunch of characters that we haven't met yet at all, what we're going to end up doing is meeting them. Actually, let's see. Can I minimize this? I think I can minimize it so that I don't have to meet too many different characters immediately. Naturally, because we're going to Tiffany and she's going to be at another location, we're going to run into someone else. Actually, you know what? Let's not do that. Let's just meet everybody. Let's just meet everybody early. Let's, let's get that out of the way. Let's head to Turtle Bay Beach where we can meet this wonderful girl. Be a good boy out there. No promises. No promises, Aiko. Are you serious? Oh, come on. Just try it on. It's going to look so cute. Try what on? There's nothing here. Come on. I saw it and I immediately thought of you. You're going to love it. I promise. Oh my. <sighs> All right. Just make sure nobody else is around. Yeah, sure. The coast is clear. <laughs> You're good. Jess, I can't wear this. What are you talking about? You look cute. Cute? Oh, stop. There's nothing wrong with the little skin. You can't keep all that boob to yourself, hun. It's not fair to the rest of the world. The world will be just fine without my... boobs. Yeah, but I won't. Besides, it wasn't cheap. So, you're stuck with it. So come on, let's go. I am not going anywhere in this. I'm changing back. Ugh, you are impossible. Enjoying the view? Quick, now's your chance. Before she goes to change, just say something, anything. All right, so we want to keep her wearing this. Let's see. I think I want to say excuse me, but if I don't stop you now, I'm going to regret it forever. What? Oh, jeez. Hi, sorry, um, I'm so embarrassed right now. My friend made me put this stupid thing on. Sorry, one second, let me go change. Your friend has good taste. That bikini was destined for you. Really? No, you think so? I don't know, it's a little revealing, don't you think? I don't want people to think I'm like that. You know? Like what? Adorable? Too late. <laughs> Shut up. You know what I mean. Hmm. Well, I guess it's not that bad. I mean, if you're really saying you like it. Oh, and hi. The person inside of the bikini you're talking to? Her name is Belly. <laughs> this is Belly. Okay, normally, Belly, I wouldn't be so rude and disappear, but I must disappear. We've got to find Aiko once again. All right, so currently, Belly is asleep at, at, in the afternoon? That's silly. That's silly. Okay, so Belly was just talking with this person who is now at the bar slash lounge. Um, one of the things I will say, I, I don't know if you realize this, but there's different phases of the day. Before, when we were talking to Aiko, it was what? It was still morning, right? No. When we went to the school and Tiffany was talking with Aiko or Ms. Yumi, uh, it was morning. There must be two afternoon. I don't know. We'll see you later. We'll see you later. When we go to the bar to talk to question mark, question mark, question mark here, it's going to be nighttime. I hope to see you soon. You too. Have a great day, Belly. Have a great day. I hope your day is going well. <laughs> 